In this manuscript, we review the multicenter experience of patients undergoing laparoscopic liver surgery in four European specialized centers. We especially focused on the progresses and on the evolution over years since the introduction of laparoscopy in liver surgery through the implementation into practice, reaching mastery of the technique. In this graph, we can see that we have an inverse trend with open resections decreasing over time, reaching a stable percentage at around 55%. Conversely, laparoscopic liver resections, so the orange line, increase with time, reaching a stable percentage at around 45%. We then focused on the most common procedure, so wedge resections, and on the most difficult procedures, so major hepatectomies and posterior superior segments. And we see that in this joint point graph, we have a positive trend over years for all three procedures. But if we analyze the relative number over the total amount of uh, procedures performed yearly, we see that wedge resections, so the green line, were initially the most common procedures performed, then they decrease with time until a stable percentage is reached. The first major hepatectomies were performed in 2002, then they increase with time until a stable percentage is reached. Conversely, for resections located in the posterior superior segments, they increase year by year, reaching the highest percentage in 2015. So since the introduction of laparoscopy and liver surgery, a long implementation process was necessary to allow for mastery of the technique and to obtain good perioperative results and safe oncological outcomes.